And so it both. begins. I think Trey has a lot of threats for Pelipper though, so like to go insta into the drizzles feels Gotta get that weather up, man. Yeah, but I mean Trey could just get rid of it with hail. Oh my, what is that? Our challenge on Sprite. <laughs> Underwave. <laughs> it's a good play. He probably thought he was gonna volt switch or something. Is that I don't know. What I'm the surprised shiny he didn't version have. looks like. I don't know. It gotta be what the shiny look like. I think he led Pelipper because he thinks Pelipper is slower, which it is. And so even if Trey led nine, I mean, yeah, if Trey led nine tails. Well, I think that's what he was Jerry hoping for. Jerry put rocks up with his. Earthquake's not doing much. I don't think he wants to earthquake this thing. I'm pretty yeah. sure Trey's game plan is to hit it with his Urshifu. Yeah, smack it. Kill it before it can get any stamina boosts. I think Trey said if he gives it stamina, he basically just loses outright. No confusion. Also, Hurricane. Or Hurricane. Instead of Bleak Wind? I guess it's just stronger. Does Bleak Wind also hit in rain? Yeah, they're yeah. both 100% in rain. Oh, okay. But Bleak Wind's 80% without, and then it's like 10, pe 10 power stronger. Oh, Ooh, no! Okay. I don't think he cares. Probably not. I don't know if close combat kills though. It definitely does. Uh, it's uh, I think he's looking to drain punch him. No uh, no white herb sneezler. What oh. <laughs> with all the sneezler health? Rocky. Ooh, helmet. Rocky helmet and life, life orb. orb and rocks. And he was here with an intimidate. Dude took thirty two percent from attacking. I'm sending him does in and attacking. <laughs> does Thunderous get defog? No. Damn. Not in this generation. To be honest, I don't think Trey expected hazards. I didn't expect Jerry to bring hazards on that team. I would expect hazards. I Gotta have hazards. I didn't think Archal, I didn't even check to see if Archal could stealth rock. I didn't really know. So Trey sent me his team beforehand, and the one Pokemon I questioned when I looked at it was Sinistra. But maybe Sinistra is the MVP. I mean, it has pretty good resistances. And if you run, like, a bulky set... It might be tough to deal with. Oh, he's running like a... Probably like a physically defensive. Maybe he got it to deal with Barrascuta. Yeah, it just beats Barrascuta. Unless Barrascuta gets Ice Fang, but I don't remember. Oh, it has Throat Chop. Ah. Or it gets Throat Chop. So that could deal with Sinistra. All I think of is Liquidation and Close Combat, so the, the, the last two moves are pretty up in the air. I think it's yeah. Flip Turn, too. It Ooh. does. But you... You flip turns good. Flip turn. Definitely want to run flip turn. And close combat and liquidation, so. <clears throat> Although close combat doesn't really do anything unless he brought back Scalibur. Yeah. Which he could have expected a back Scalibur. 
I mean, if you have screens, the mon goes crazy. Yeah, like... Uh, Which then, if he does that, I would have brought Psychic Fangs on... Yeah, on Bearskuda. Uh, Bearskuda. It might also get Brick Break, but I'm not sure. And normally with these weather team, weather teams, you you run your weather mon, and then you you run one mon that like does really good in weather, like Bearskew to Pelipper and Titar Excadrill, and maybe Nine Tails Walking Wake. But Trey just brought Nine Tails, and that was it. No nine tails backscalibur I am, synergy. I really thought backscalibur was coming. I, I would have. Like, I know. I get not wanting to bring him into like our Caladon, but wow! I think he's good against everyone else. <laughs> I did too. I thought he'd be better than Sinistra. Maybe he's worried about the ice resistances. But at that point, just don't run an ice move. Just do like. Swords Dance, Outray, or Glaive Rush. I mean, that alone would have been... I mean, yeah, Jerry doesn't have any Fairy types, huh? Yeah, you just... Swords Dance, maybe a Scale Shot to get the speed boost, and then you out you could, Glaive you Rush. Could do, you could do Loaded Dice Scale Shot on him. That would be some fire. The, the only good. issue is if you hit Archaladon, you have to switch out immediately. Yeah. Well, scale shot into our Chaladon would be kind of tough. Yeah. What would they do? Like twenty percent and give them two point five times defense. <laughs> and anybody Trey knows or Trey have like learned Roar or Whirlwind? <laughs> that wouldn't have been as bad if you could just cycle yeah. it out. Dragon Tail, Backscalibur, Dragon Tail. Oh yeah. Ooh, that's certain. Ooh, it's tanking. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, Actually, he did dra not win Dragon Tail would have been really good against it now that I think about it. He does not win the exchange. Oh, wait, maybe he does. But if he just keeps swords dancing, he needs a burn. Ooh, that's wait. kind of. He might just clear Oh, because he matched it. Okay. Punch. I was like, why didn't he gain his. He should have just done Strength Sap one more time and then. I don't know. He needed a burn. No, you're right. He doesn't win that trade, though. Yeah, because you just keep SD, and it doesn't matter. Yeah, because he's getting up two as opposed to you taking him down one. Yeah. Caesar always wins oh. that. Uh, ooh. T-Wave's going that in, though. Wave. Yeah, that T-Wave was good. Thunderous doesn't even learn a fire move, I don't think. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. Can it learn Hex? Oh, the Dragon Bolt build on it? Oh my gosh, the crit on the bullet so, punch. Now, like, now he just needs to... Yeah, I probably didn't. Oh. Yeah, it's at 2.5. I don't think it matters. <laughs> it's a good thing this dude had more priority. Holy shit. Barely. Bullet punch might have cleared. I don't know. Actually, I don't know if it would have... Uh, no, there's no, uh, Urshifu isn't the water one, so. Yeah, if he didn't have priority, he might have just been cooked there. From Good the news here point is five the Caledon's taking, taking a good yeah. amount of chip. So far, it looks like, uh. I think Trey's actually in a better position than what it looks. I don't know. I mean, is that our Caledon's taken how much? And that was the biggest threat. As long as he preserves nine tails, I think he's good. I think he can. Yeah. Oh, that didn't that's do not, enough. That's not good. Ooh, we got the citrus. The citrus. Ooh, we got the citrus berry. Oh yeah, What's the, the citrus anger shot or whatever. Or body press or yeah, electro shots. That, that that's kid. what I was thinking. Ooh, it's oh, vested. He should have done body press, dude. Why didn't he have body press on this thing? Urshifu, can he learn body press? No, I'm talking uh, Archaladon. Archaladon can. Oh. But yeah, because then you just... That assault vest was that super would clutch. Deal. To not take any damage from an electro shot, even yeah. with the spidef drop. That's crazy. I thought yeah. for sure yeah, he lost it the moment. 
Yeah, as soon as it hit, Ooh, I was like... Berry hit. Once, I thought, once I saw the citrus berry, Ooh. I was like, that's not what I expected. So this is what he needed to have nine tails healthy for, so he can kill Tornadus. But now that makes you wonder. Well, I guess Trey did the Calyx. I was going to say, because I'm like, what if he assault vested the... Uh, or Caledon, but he didn't. He went citrus berry, which I think is wild. One of that bulk. The Trey has, like, half special attackers on his team. Kind of crazy he didn't assault vest it. But that bulk! I think it's, I mean, I think Jerry just, that's what he was predicting, though. That, uh, Ooh. blizzard. Oh. The offensive? Does he have the freeze dry? The offensive? Nine tails? See, oh, now. wait, if he's freeze dry, Barrasquita Bar might sweep right now, anyway. Oh, think... he shouldn't have, uh,. I wouldn't have brought it in there. I would have let him kill Pelipper. He's got to pull. He's got to pull. He's got to switch out. Yeah. Yeah. You switch out because the then snow. you can preserve the fact that you can. Yeah. yeah he's going to have to sack out. something though. And Pelipper's dead. Next time it switches in, I think Trey wins. Trey won. Yeah, I think this. I is don't there. know if Barrasquita might might still. Well, pull you got to think his speed's about to be halved. But the next time that yeah, I'm but he's already back. so he's already so quick though. He should be fast. Uh, Sneasler should be faster depending on. Well, uh, the, never uh, mind. He's life I think, orb. No, but I think yeah. Trey's. I think Trey brought scarf on his. But nine tails. Uh, yeah. What I'm saying is this. Uh, yeah, it's weird that he you, could you wizard. Have, you have it's his really team. Weird. He has scarfed nine tails. Yeah. Should I say? I don't want to look. I want to guess. I think. Uh, ooh, if it is scarf. Then he just needs to hit. But, Either way, I think he should stay in because his best bet at living a hit is probably Quagsire. And his best bet at... I think it's fine, but ooh, like, even when he switches back in, even nah. if this dies, oh, look, he's going to switch back in and get rid of the rain. Yeah, this Maybe boy. it isn't banded. That didn't do much. Mine, or it is banded. Should, I was going to say Skewda should be... Uh slower than Sneasler because of being adamant, but... You, oh, you think you know he's running adamant? I don't know, but I would I would think he... If you're already faster than his whole team, I would think you just run adamant. Yeah. Or maybe he was worried about Sneasler being faster. Oh, we got the poison! That's actually really good. Can't get stalled out by the quag. Wait, I think he made it the Ooh, skewed. The extra hazards are crazy. Skewed dies when he comes in. Yeah, that's actually that's toxic. <laughs> so now he just has to kill uh, this overquill and it's over. Yeah, that's rough. The hazards kind of screwed him over. No earthquake, though. Oh, oh, there it is. <laughs> Look at all that healing. Problem is, I don't think Overquill... Uh, I don't know if it lives a, a blizzard. I mean, he's pretty defensive, right? Even without investment. So he can switch out and get the Intimidate proc again. I think it's just over, though. I mean, whatever, yeah. like... He can't switch out because everything just dies to Hazard. He gets one Intimidate proc again if he switches out. And uh, he still gets hit by the Dire Claw status. You know, like... Yeah, it's over. Let's watch some stuff die to hazards. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Dang. That's game. The hazards, man. And they did a gentleman's to just run it back. Alright, I gotta get his thing again.
having uh having nine tails is kind of matches up. Nice. Yep. Because if he has freeze dry, I mean, it's like, what do you do? What do you switch in? So the big problem was uh, Thunderous T-waving everything, I think. That made it so annoying for Jerry. Yeah, he could have won with, with Scizor if he hadn't gotten T-waved. I mean, I, I think me that was his game plan, though, was yeah, the T-wave things. Yeah, I think BP would have swept. Without a ground type on your entire team, like how do you deal with T-wave coming up? Or an electric type? You didn't bring either. Yeah, he kind of just has to kill it. <laughs> Thunderous is crazy. Yeah, I don't know. It's a tough matchup with the possible freeze dry and then Thunderous. Crazy. Jerry is didn't bring insane. the boom. Jerry didn't bring the boom or his belly bolt. The belly bolt would have been really good. Who's a uh, Jerry's terror captain? It is Overquill. So, he, I guess he never he also needed, didn't bring Caldia. needed, never needed to terrestrialize his overquill, but it would have been cool if he was Terra Grass, Terra Blast, could kill Quagsire in one hit. Maybe not bringing Boom is criminal. Deja vu. Deja vu. I think we've been in this place before. I think this is exactly the start that Trey wants every single time. Oh, yeah. He has the hardest time dealing with our Chaladon. So he kind of gets to cripple it. Knock off. Door stance. Saw this trade before. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry said, "Going for game." Oof. T wave. Oh, that's yeah. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Ooh. This man gets hacked. Oh my gosh, dude. I don't know. I, I would have switched. I would have switched to our Chaladon there because you can always bring Scizor back to get plus whatever again. Anyway, dude, what do you go into here? You go into Urshifu? No, you like. <laughs> you should eat you. Sneasler instead of Urshifu. Okay. Now he can just BP and pray to not get parried. Yeah. It's a big. But one. now Urshifu Urshifu... comes in. And... Well, no, oh. he can Thunderbolt and kill, guaranteed. Yeah, he probably... I don't know if he dies from... Bolt oh, my bolt. God, he's 1% short of being able to just uh, Volt Switch and kill him. It's a roll. Okay, it does 53. <laughs> Maybe that crit mattered. Maybe it did. Yeah, <laughs> that didn't did. do a whole lot. Yeah, doing only 50 at plus whatever. <laughs> plus four. Yeah, that's crazy. I thought it'd do more for some reason. I did two Thunders isn't bulky at, at all. Yeah, it's kind of squishy, right? Big squish. So that's this is good for Trey, though, because if he lost Sneasler and Urshifu, it's just over. Definitely his answer to Arcaladon, though. Yeah. And it cl it's clear Jerry has no answers for the hazards. Yeah. He's not running a single like heavy duty boots either. No, his whole yeah. team takes damage. There's isn't a big deal for our Chaladon or um, Caesar, but I don't think it like seems like a big deal at first. But every time he's had to switch out or whatever, I think it does end up mattering. Oh yeah. Well, it spikes because then it makes it makes the potential of like oh, there's other Trey's other pokes being able to oko it. 
And quite literally, the only healing our Caladon gets is Citrus Berry. <laughs> Punch. Yummy. See, he can get him down to 40, or no, what was it? It did 34% uh, Wicked Blow. I don't remember. I think the Wicked Blow did 34 last game, so that's like, it doesn't matter how many stamina our Chaladon gets as long as he can Wicked Blow it. Yeah. Goes into what Quagsire here? On the Astral, Bar Astral Barrage? Yep. Yep. Talk Could get sorry. a spike up if you want. Yeah, you just put up his spikes. No more Sneasler. So Jerry can probably play this slower. Man, the Pelipper taking a quarter of its health bar every time, though. No boots. That's good. Go on, get out of there. So that thing has boots. Double spikes layer. Wait, has that thing always had heavy duty boots? I guess so. He can win with Tornadus. As long as he kills Ninetales. Knocks off Ninetales boots. It's a free, free hit now. Oh. Boom. Doesn't matter though. You sure she comes in and just cleans it up. Kills that Archalada. He can hit any one of his moves and kill it. Unless he has like poison drip. For the rest of his team, I think it's team, crazy that stamina triggers off of even non-contact moves. He probably wants to click close combat no matter what, just to do the most chip he can to overquill. But Dark Chaladon's dead, so he's gonna take the hit no matter what. Yeah, now Nine Tails can sweep you. Freeze dry, freeze dry, freeze dry. And it'll take away the rain, so his hurricane's no longer accurate. Say hey, the Ninetales was scarf too, or no? Pretty sure you said he's scarfing it. I mean, that's smart. The uh, outspeed, hazards. like everything. Immediately deals with Barrascuta if it's scarfed. Yeah. Aqua Jet was pretty cool. Yeah, if you're not if you're not running boots, you're running some funky. <laughs> that poison is gonna hurt. I'm pretty sure freeze dry just sweeps here. He can get more health back on tornadoes if he wants. What's that rain? Four times effective. Now, is but is Scar faster than Swiss Swim? Not in no, not not uh, in the rain. If he Absolutely. pulls out, but then he takes. Yeah, he might die to hazards, right? Mm, no, I think he'll he'll get the he'll get the swing. They were the fangs. Because it's just it's just the stealth rocks damage he's gonna take. Thirty-two. And he can't bring rain back. Oh. Now, will he die to poison, though? That's. So he gets to blizzard both of them. Ooh, that might, that... Yeah, so now uh, he, should, he should Oko here. Yeah, I don't think it lives, right? Wow. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. 3%. That's crazy. crazy. Oh. oh, my God. Great game. Yeah, that was good. What a first game of the season. Uh, I knew it was going to be Choice Scarf 2.
in the first game, I was like, man, I'm going to press this button and it's going to be choice card and I'm going to get clapped. Oh, no, my God. I can't believe I did that. <laughs> All right. What are your thoughts from the loser? Thoughts from the winner? Um, my thoughts are I forgot that Thunderous could press the button Thunder Wave, and that's why I lost. <laughs> yeah, Belly Bolt would have been good. What about you, Trey? I think that I spent all week prepping so much shit, and a lot of it worked out exactly how I thought, and I'm pleasantly Ooh, surprised. <laughs> and I believe you didn't bring the caliber. The caliber. I thought it was better. I can't believe Jerry didn't bring the belly bolt. You know what didn't do anything? <laughs> I wanted to bring it. Sinistra yeah. did not do anything. So that I wish I would have had Electro T Sui. The Pokemon yes. is not good into my. Uh... Team. I re I instantly regretted it. Like I instantly <laughs> regretted it you when I saw me... Scizor. When I like, saw Scizor, I was like, "Fuck." Well, I, I I don't even know what it counters. It just dies to everything. You sent me your it team. Kinda, it's another thing to put in in front of Barrasquita, but it just never worked out like that. I saw. Yeah, well, that's what the uh, most in, Odie said. The know. most important Pokemon on your team, the one I was referring to earlier, is of course the Quagsire. Obviously, yes, anyone with half a brain can look at your yes. team and my team and say, if that guy lets Quagsire die, he loses. Yes, yes. Yeah. That guy was so important. That was the first, when I was building my team, it was the first Pokemon that I built. <laughs> I, my Pokemon just don't get good moves to kill it. And what yeah, I was, really, I, I was just worried about Rillaboom. Does, I was like, it's going to be so hard if he brings Rillaboom because Quagsire is so important and I'm going to have to like... I made so much shit for Rillaboom this game. That's the other thing Sinister was there for. See, Jerry could have gotten more creative with that Terra Grass, Terra Blast, Overquill. I thought that's what was coming. I, that too. Like, that yeah. fucking shit's on Quagsire. No, I just thought... So, I forgot that Thunder Wave exists. And the second that Sizzle... My whole strategy was Thunder Wave. That was my <laughs> whole strategy. So cool, I would have had a different item on Scizor, and you would have lost the game if I remembered both games. I would that... have lost the first game if I didn't get Parahags. Yeah, because I would have remembered, and because I put Covert Cloak, so I was like, that, that'll that protect me from Mini Sinisha, or I don't even know if Quagsire still gets Scald, but Scald. Oh, you had Covert Cloak? Oh, yeah. fuck. I was pressing Mashigacha for nothing. I know, I was like, this oh. guy's cooked. And then I got hit by a T-Wave, and I was like, oh, that should have been a Lumberry, because <laughs> I, I get to put this in on Quagsire, press Sword Stance for free, and then he tries yeah. to T-Wave me, I kill him with a knockoff. Yeah. And then the rest of his team is like gonna get o code by. I knew my MVP, my sweeper was gonna be Scarf Nine Tails. Like I just was like, this smacks his whole team. If I can just get rid of the shit that it can't smack. Was your Sneasler faster? Was there potential to be faster than the Bear Skewed? Was Bear Skewed a band? Uh, Adam. Uh, it was. It was gonna be one point faster than my Bear Skewed. The yeah. Sneasler was. Yeah. That's what not. I, I had. I, I didn't intend for that oh, to that happen. Didn't, that didn't really matter. Oh uh, yeah, I had I just the yeah, Sneasler. The scarf yeah. nine tails made it not matter. I, too. Well, it's it's also just like the scarf nine tails is uh, bad. It's just the thunderous. It's just anything that I I knew there was a scarf somewhere. And I just didn't figure it out, and then the nine tails came out. And I was like, man, this is going to be the thing that has the scarf. And I pressed <laughs> my button anyway, and out came a blizzard. Pew. Because I don't have good ice resists on my team. Yeah. Other than Caesar, and that's the thing that I need to MF and kill basically the entirety of Trey's team. Freeze drive. I the... you don't have anything to get rid of hazard, so spike stealth rocks OP. I technically do. Scizor can press <laughs> defog, but I wasn't that's about to true. bring it on the thing because the like, if I had a Lumberry on Caesar, your Quagsire was also screwed beyond belief. Not just because of, like, knockoff, but it had Trailblaze. And I know you have Water Absorb Quagsire because you have to have Water Absorb Quagsire. Yeah, I do, yeah. So the Trailblaze at plus two is Okoing. He just never made it there. He got T-Wave. Yeah. I forgot what T -wave, that T-Wave exists. I was like, this Thunderous is going to be... Specs. My whole team was also bulky. The yeah. only Pokemon no, that was EV'd for, <laughs> for for anything offensive was Ninetales. Yeah. 
I could tell. Like, I made their natures, like, it was modest.